descending out of the sky. This is so amazing. Hundreds of them scrabbling over this Nyala. There'll be nothing left here very, very soon. Try and count them coming in. Look at them all. Wow, this is fantastic. This is truly, I mean, this is astonishing. Now, it sounds to me quite a lot like Jamie might have the rest of the pack up where she is. That loud calling. Look at them go. They just got a bit of a fright because a vehicle came in, but they'll come straight back. They'll come straight back. Oh, this is amazing. We are really lucky today. They're coming in from all angles, everyone, and they follow each other in. All whiteback vultures so far, no other species. I think Jamie's got a good idea there. I think it might well be that the rest of the pack is up somewhere to the north of us. You can hear the ripping sound that the vultures are making there. It's just fantastic. Ewes. Also, them sort of scrabbling around on the ground, and there are two lots of vultures here. Some of them eating the rest of the carcass that they left, and then others that have gone towards the stomach contents <coughs> on the other side. Just, Zander, if you don't mind, can you go up? Just look at them all coming in here. <laughs> you won't believe what I just saw. One of them fell out of a tree, tried to catch up or catch on with its long neck and then it plummeted out and just managed to kind of take flight. Look at them all coming in. And there's not a lot to eat here, everybody. This will all be gone in seconds, or in certainly in minutes. And by the time it's gone, all these, a lot of these vultures will just sit here in the trees. And so if you were to come by here and you didn't know what had happened, you'd assume that something had died here. <clears throat> oh, that's just brilliant. Huh. And now everything's kind of gone to peace. Uh, when are we first, that first bird we saw, I think just before you lost us, I thought it was a tawny, um, a Wahlbergs, it wasn't, it was a tawny, definitely. And the tawny and the battalier that would have swooped in here would have led these vultures to this kill. And then they would have had to fly off the battalier and the tawny because they will not compete with much bigger white-backed vultures. Amber, you want to know how fast they'll be able to eat this before it's all gone. I don't think this will last more than half an hour. And then I think it will all be done. There'll just be a few bones left. And something's coming in and giving them a fright. A lot of them have just taken off. Not sure what that would have been. Can't see anything around here. No vehicles have come in. Just fantastic.
plastic stuff. Wonderful light. Hmm. And Sally, in Oregon, of course, we don't often see this sort of thing. And you're saying, is it normal for the vultures to behave like this? Absolutely. Completely normal. We just don't often see them like this. And I think that's because there aren't that many of them around anymore. But yes, completely, they will fight over each other. They scrap.